Metro. Okay, I'm going to turn it off. This is a for sure sign of a weak CRT. Watch this. They realized that could be hard. You kind of changed the city. Still there. Still there. You know what really matters this season is that you're gifting on all cylinders and that you max out your unsecured credit card debt and be a good consumer. That's what really matters this season. That's what it's all about. It's about gifting on all cylinders. I'll tell you what. This thing is uh, not gifting on all cylinders. It will be after I get the dirt off. It'll probably brighten it up quite a bit. Check this tuner out. Is this a trip or what? Guess there's coils on the back. I sprayed it down. What a trip. You know, I'd like to see this thing work, even if it's just receiving audio before I go forward fixing it. Who knows why this was retired? It's uh, uh, it might need some actual diagno diagnosis and repairs, and not just caps. So I'd, I I might go through this and actually kind of troubleshoot this and get it working before I do a bulk recap. It looks like it's from a heavy smoker environment. I mean, really, really cigarette. Cigarette it out. Catch freeze! Hey, Homer, you gonna kiss him or kill him? Weird, now it's working. <laughs> oh, dang! Tender boy! Whoa, Okay, so what are you? Must be a secret government project. Whoa, what do I look like, a narc? My name is Ben, and I come from the future. Prove it. What happens to Homer Simpson in the future? I don't know. Oh. He's telling the truth. I have to take you to our civic leaders. Hey, Hibachi Head, how are you going to pay for that? Ah, uh, let me just transfer some uh, electronic hypercredits into your register here. Ding, 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 ding. Ooh, and uh, another round for my friend. Ding, 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 ding. Ah! Hey, this Blade Rummy is all right. He's a big spender. Plus, he fits the jukebox. I think they had a thing going. Oh, baby, what you done to me? I hate it when they get quiet. Listen, uh. I know you're a robot and incapable of emotion. <laughs> True. I'm empty inside. <laughs> uh, look, I just want to ask, can we be friends? Hey, that's You're pretty the only bright. Guy I know with less hair than me. Sure. That's why I came to your time. For all you know. For all, all we know. know. <laughs> I'm going to hook the antenna directly to it. Okay, that doesn't look too bad. I reset the DirecTV box. It's very blurry for some reason. Not to be, but to take.
Who knows why the high voltage is working all of a sudden? Maybe because I moved the uh, I moved the horizontal um, oscillator tube around. I can't believe it works this good. It actually does look better in than it does on the camera. On the camera, it looks washed out, and it could use some more contrast. That could also be a weak CRT or maybe AGC. Maybe I should hook the. Um, Maybe I should hook the, the output directly to it. I just got a wire dangling there. It's picking up the RF from the air. Okay, that's what the BT modulator fed directly into the thing. Um, BT modulator has one hell of a output. I don't even have the power turned up all the way. Bring you an important bulletin. The horrific creatures destroying New New York have begun metamorphosing. <laughs> what a surprise. It's Bart. Wow, I'm doing the same jokes a thousand years later. I can remember. Stay far, is it? Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, we definitely got a problem with the um, horizontal oscillator tube, and I'm sure that's why it was doing what it was doing in the first video. If I move, there you go. Just look at that. Look at how sticky that is. You could just lick that and you wouldn't even need your nicotine patch for the day. And this is old. Oh, check out the asbestos tube shield. That's the first time I've seen an asbestos tube shield. All right, I had a discussion with the owner about this and He's, his use is going to be so minimal of this, maybe a half hour, a month or so. What we decided to do, because the CRT is on the weak side, and because the thing is such high hour, and I'm just afraid, I'm just afraid to touch anything because if something breaks, uh, some of this old plastic stuff is so hard. I'm going to just spot check a few of these electrolytics, or these capacitors. Uh, I'm going to pull this one. Uh, this is the filter for the um, for the the screen. So we'll take that one and check it. And then this one is the boost filter. And these are a couple of the two that can are more, most often to short. 
And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, I'm going to do I'm going to uh, ESR the electrolytics, and if they're good, we're going to leave it. He's going to try it. If there's a problem, he'll bring it back. I don't know what I'm going to do about the seleniums yet. I got to check into that. Okay. Well, to start off, here's the point zero zero four seven, and I'm on C three. I want to be and there's nobody at all home could that thing just be wide open how about uh, let's do some leakage testing here no leakage uh, C2 zero four seven the end is popped out. I wonder if it's open. Okay, here's a new .047 and there's an eye opening right there. .047. Well, that's not a good look when you suggest to the owner that we should just do a minimum on this thing and the first capacitor you test is dead wide open. That's not a that's not a selling point. Okay, here's a this is a zero twenty two at sixteen hundred. This is the boost filter, and that one's good. I can't test this at 1600 but we'll test it at 450 and it's good at least at 450 well better take a closer look at the rest of this I guess I recently was watching a restore video and the person soldering just made me cringe so I wanted to just go over something we all know which is that you want to create a solid mechanical connection before you solder it. If you see how I've created that joint right there, this joint right here, and the same thing down here, and up here, I've rewrapped it around, I'm going to tighten it up, and then I'm going to solder it. But the, the restore I saw was just laying the wires next to each other and blobbing solder on them. No, it needs to be a solid mechanical. Alright, I'm fairly impressed with how this came out. Uh, I started off just repairing, replacing a couple capacitors and I ended up replacing almost all of them so uh, it's working real good right now even though most of them tested good I checked the B plus I checked perfect the sound is good uh, no buzzing no nothing so I'm going to um, clean it up put it back together the the owner and I talked about it we decided to keep the repairs to a minimum because of the age of the CRT the hours on the CRT and the flyback condition and he lives locally here so if there's any further problems with it he's gonna bring it back uh, and we'll follow up on it all the electrolytics the ESR checked real good so, uh, no leakage and good ESR on the electrolytics, which is pretty amazing. So, we're going to, um, we're going to button it up and test it, and that's it. Terry traveled to France. Meanwhile, the U.S. and France will share this more... This is checking the plate current. Pentagon officials have ordered an end to some review procedures that were delaying the rapid sharing of time-sensitive intelligence. Antonio? 
Jamie McIntyre at the Pentagon. CIA Director John Brennan says Friday's attacks in Paris looks are good. One -off. Remember, I had figured 102, and um, this is checking the plate plate current on a horizontal output tube is fairly dangerous. That's why you never really hear about anyone doing it. Um, that's why I use this kind of standalone meter, and I it's the the pulses aren't this high. Uh, uh, aren't really that high on a black and white, but they are high on a color set. So if you do this, you got to use a standalone little meter like this that can handle the high voltage pulses, and uh, you got to be real careful. I got to say, the amount of cigarette paste in this thing is just absolutely heroic. We're going to clean this up real nice and put this all we're gonna clean this up all nice and put this back together geez I think I'm gonna about just double the brightness just by cleaning the cigarette crust out of it look at this thing how many shades lighter and brighter and shinier is this thing than it was the first time. I'll have to do a mashup. Here's the old, here's the new. Alright, now just to let it run for a couple days and make no, they, sure it's originally the, uh, done nothing fails. Alright, just to kind of sum this up, I've been watching the news on this thing for about the past four days and it's been rock solid so I'm gonna let it go home it can always come back if something goes wrong with it uh, I did I did find an antenna for it here it's just it's just a F for aesthetics pretty much and the other thing I did was I stuck a couple feet on the back Let's buy these at Home Depot um, under here and the reason why I did that well was two reasons the main one was of course it needs a gap here so it can suck cool air in the bottom as the heat rises and flows out the top so it can draw cool air through this air gap and the other reason is is just uh, where the old feet were missing from it was just gouging everything that I set it on so I think it's uh, ready to go back home and um, looking good. But only cover the edges, leaving big dark spots. Finally, you can have decorative lighting where it was impossible before. With the old-fashioned lights, bulbs went out, strings got tangled. I had to get up on a ladder. I had to put nails in my house. With Star Shower, all of that goes away. Now it's one product, and my life is much easier. Use them close up to highlight a favorite tree or bush for instant nighttime. Didn't know so much of your life your depended on the lights Halloween and getting up on a ladder, you loser. In just seconds, your 4th of July will sparkle with fireworks of your own. When I have a party, I spice it up with Star Shower. I love them, and my guests can't keep their eyes off them. Same old Christmas decorations? Now make them exciting with Star Shower. Use them year-round, anywhere around your home. Even bring the stars indoors to light up a foyer or create a fantasy world in the little one's bedroom. I hate hanging lights. With Star Shower, I can light up my entire house in no time. And they look amazing. Stop wasting hours hanging old-fashioned lights or spending hundreds buying new lights year after year. Light up your home with the classic green Star Shower laser light today for just $39.99. But wait, if you're one of the first 1,000 callers to order now, we'll give you an instant upgrade to the deluxe red-green dual laser star shower. Just click for the classic green laser, or click again for the dual red and green super shower. Plus, there's more. Order now and we'll upgrade you for free to the extra-long, ultra-durable star shower steak attachment. Much longer and thicker than other steaks. Plus, when you call, find out how to get the star shower deluxe indoor bay. Okay, so stars what is the hour life of this laser? For a special price when you call now. Star Shower comes with a huge 60-day money-back guarantee. If it's not the best decorative light solution you've ever used, just send it back for a full refund. No questions asked. 
You get it all, the upgraded red-green dual laser star shower plus the extra long super steak. Okay, watch what happens when I crank the brightness up, how it goes out of focus and, and smears. Watch. to get your star shower. Call or go to getstarshower.com. Call 1-800-486-3420. That's 1-800-486-3420. Got a text down here. Order right now. Welcome back. We've seen some incredible lighting transfer. That's a weak CRT. You've seen why Star Shower is the easiest, fastest, least expensive way to illuminate your entire home with thousands of gorgeous stars. And not just the outside. Look at this. You can light up the indoors too, and you can do this. It's simple, it's fast, and it's convenient when you have the Star Shower Deluxe indoor base. Setup is Glad it's deluxe. Right here, VIP service guarantee and upgraded at no charge to an industry first lifetime VIP service guarantee. If anything goes wrong for as long as you own the This is like that crimson, that gore. Oh, you go wear a choker. Okay. Yeah, you go wear a choker. Okay, so we got what did it we got all of these music video channels. None of them play music videos. We got CMT. We got BET. Whatever this is. It's not music videos though. MTV hasn't played music videos since the 80s. MTV2 hasn't played video since the 90s. I don't know what this is. Something new. VH1 Classic. I guess this is the Doors movie. Views. This used to be music videos. Members Salvation. Nancy and Newt from Valrico. I told you mortgaging my house. I wanted to make this pillow last 10 years at least. And my patented fill, this won't go flat for 10 years. I've been around now, guess what? 10 years! Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, congratulations. 10 years and uh... The way to protect the people. Charles, thank you very much. We appreciate it. Many of the events in Paris have been canceled this week, but stores and museums are open again. And Parisians are getting back to work, finding some comfort in their daily routine. Adam Rainey has the latest. This is Al Jazeera. Not business as usual. This is okay, I guess. Heaviness as Parisians start their first It's not as good as RT, but... ...deadly attacks here. You can see people burdened by a weariness, a pain, a nagging fear. But many are happy to have something to do, somewhere to go. Let's yeah, keep on the movie, let's go to work, let's go to dance, let's go to, to eat and uh, drink. Uh, so the, the, the life doesn't go, doesn't uh, stop. Despite positive sentiments, danger seems ever close. Over the PA system, a warning about a suspicious package on the metro. Okay, I'm going to turn it off. This is a for sure sign of a weak CRT. Watch this. They realize that could be hard. We kind of changed the city. Still there. Still there. Still there. I know it's gone out of the cameras thing, but it's still there. Oh, there it's gone. Alright, we'll turn it back on.
United States. What needs to be done to guard against it? We continue our coverage from Paris right after this. Tomorrow morning on Al Jazeera America. More airstrikes against ISIL as the hunt for those behind the attacks in Paris intensifies. We'll have all the details from the overnight developments. Tomorrow, 7 Eastern on Your World This Morning, only on Al Jazeera America. Crafty chemical companies have deceived us for generations. Once you start using their furniture polishes, you have to keep adding more and more layers just to create a false shine. Finally, there's a pure and simple furniture polish from a pure and simple people. Introducing Dutch Glow. Based on a century-old woodworker's formula, it easily cleans, polishes, and nourishes all of the woodwork in your home. The simple ingredients in Dutch Glow Amish Wood Milk break down years of wax buildup, revealing your furniture's natural glow. Did you know most water rings are actually a discoloration in the wax buildup? Dutch Glow easily removes those embarrassing heat rings and watermarks. And in the kitchen, it's like a magician on your cabinets, removing cooking grease, smoke stains, and fingerprints that build up over time. Sounds like this TV needs some of this. Into a gold mine. Waxes and polishes can leave a sticky residue that attracts dust. So we cleaned half of this table and broke open a down pillow to show how Dutch Glow attracts less dust so you'll clean less often. My company cleans thousands of homes and offices every year. And we even trust Amish wood milk on painted wood surfaces because harsh chemical cleaners can etch your painted wood over time. When they're outside the lines, Dutch Glow comes through every time. Use Dutch Glow on oak, cherry, pine, maple, teak, hickory, and on any painted wood surface too. It'll also remove scuff marks from baseboards and cabinet doors. Join the generations of sportsmen that trust Amish wood milk for their wood. Call now and get your bottle of Dutch Glow for just ten dollars we'll also include a second bottle of dutch glow with our special wood floor nozzle just pay separate shipping and processing but if you call right now we'll even include our jumbo microfiber polishing cloth absolutely free you get it all a huge value here's how to order to order go 1-800-871-2434 and get two bottles of dutch glow for just 